Alright, hello, and we're back for some more L.A. Noir. Oh me, oh my. Now, let's move on forward here. Uh, where we left off, we just talked to this freaking fire, um, this freaking valve regulator douchebag. Um, or valve company douchebag. Not, not valve as in steam and half-life, but, you know, actual valves for fire things. Um, and, uh... We get a choice here. We got three different employees of his who both have some uh, skeletons behind their closets. And, um... Or in their closets, whatever. Um, and we get to we get to pick our poison here. Which, who we go to first. And, um... I don't know. I, I don't know if it really matters. I don't remember what it's like going to each of them. Um... I guess we'll just do it in order. <laughs> Wait, Clemens, Farley. Nah, eh, whatever. We'll just do it in order. I don't, I don't know. Do whatever. Play it by the year. Oh yeah, let's go. Get out of this shithole. Freaking insta heat. That's what it was called. Fucking thing sucks. All right. And I actually had to replay that last little bit where we go to the Insta Heat offices. Apparently it didn't save where I left off because this game sucks and doesn't have cool, good, uh, pro auto saving abilities. And you can't quick save. Although, quick saving in a game like this, I feel like, would, would be kind of weird, but. But, I don't know. I don't think it would matter, per se, but, yeah. It does feel kind of weird thinking about it for this game. Uh, maybe that's just because I'm not. Maybe it's just because it's not in place to begin with. I don't know. I mean, it's certainly not a Fallout or a Mass Effect, but you know. <laughs> uh. Although I feel like a game like GTA should have that, but whatever. That's that's long overdue. Oh, okay. This is awkward. This is what happens when you don't pay attention when you're driving. <laughs> Everyone. Oh boy. Why are you getting all worked up? Like, seriously, I'm not even nowhere fucking near you, idiots. Jesus Christ. <laughs> he just drops his suitcase like, Oh, I'm out of here. Ah, <laughs> uh, car. Car that's all the way across the street from me. Biggs, LAPD. We want some answers and we want them quick. Okay, yeah, okay. or we shoot you. What's this all about? This guy, what you want. this guy looks like someone familiar. I can't quite put my finger on it, though. I can't quite put my finger on it. He kind of looks like Leonardo DiCaprio, actually, but... Whatever. You know Reginald Barley? No? Can't say I do. Well, you work with him. I don't know about that one. You have a real viper's nest at Insta-Heat, don't you? Viper? Artists, murderers, or communists. Oh my god, What's communists! Oh no! I'm behind all that? I don't think Cole cares about communists. I think that one was a slight... Slight ta slight tack or a slight stab at the hysteria. Let's see. Anarchist propaganda for also it's anarchism, it's not communism. It's just like two different things. <laughs> Let's see. Um those are actually two very different things in a way. I mean it depends. I guess there's anarcho communism, but I don't know anything about I don't know anything about that and how exactly that works. I feel like that's almost it's almost a contradiction in terms, but yeah. anyway, um, anarchist propaganda. Oh, uh, sorry, um, Ryan. To be frank, you look like you haven't got a clue. Okay. So there's nothing to say. Sorry, I'm like <laughs> I was busy talking, so wasn't focused. But there's nothing to say that he knows him based on evidence, although they do work at the same place. So. It's reasonable to suspect that they must. Looks like I was mistaken. Doubt, bitch. Detroit PD is after Reginald Barley for murder. Yeah, bitch. You know anything about that? For aiding and abetting Clemens. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> All I know about Barley is he gets kickbacks from. This is how Boston people. This is how you speak to Boston he people. Around if you can. Threaten him. Oh, what do you say? Oh well. How is your employment with Insta Heat? You devilish little bastard, you. 
I don't even remember what we got you for. What 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 are, what are you what were you in for? I don't remember. You were licensed and worked for Instaheat. I contract for them. So what? Um. You like fires, don't you, Clemens? Okay, yeah, you she's an arsonist. The house on Avenue. You manipulated the regulator valve. I don't remember even working a job on Kenmore Avenue, much less sabotaging the place. What proof have you? Uh huh. Uh. You, the regular valve that you installed there, which blew up or got destroyed. I mean, it doesn't really do you much good saying that, like, I don't remember. And then, what proof do you have that I did that there, huh, bitch? And then we're like, here it is. And you're like, oh. Uh. Let's see. Saw your family here destroyed after being... We're talking to Clemens, right? Oh. Wait. Oh. There was no heater destroyed under Clemens. Whoops. Uh. Either of you two know how to do some soldering? You can't just stand around here all day doing nothing. All right. You're off the hook. It's probably doubt again. Is the heat hires arsonists, does it? I've worked as a fitter all my life. Put everything I had into that house. And my fucking mud shark of a wife gets awarded it in the settlement. She's blowing spicks two at a time while oh, okay. I'm at work. And oh, okay, I see. Yeah, I burned it's it all right. Marital issues, I get it. it Domestic problems. I did my time and I'd do it again. Sorry about the rouse, Clemens. You did the right thing. <laughs> oh. Damn. Alright, cool. I'm guessing there's probably there's probably some backstory to that one. Probably some projecting on his part there, on my partner's part there. Let's see. Do you know Matthew Ryan? No. Don't know the name. Oh, oh okay. Now we, we know this one's a lie. This you're one's definitely a lie. <laughs> and how do you figure what the fuck that does that mean? What, proof do you have? what is a fifth, what is a fifth columnist even? Me the hell? <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> Wait, didn't you just kind of prove that you're a fifth columnist by saying meeting that you're, that we're by suggesting that we might be following you to meetings and stuff. Okay, hold on. Um, here you go. A pamphlet in your locker, Clemens. We can add your name to the register. Huack might want to interview you. That shit was I don't even know what that is. He's always okay. pushing that shit on people. Drives me nuts. Why'd you take it? He's got it in for the company. Bitch. <laughs> All right, Clemens. You're off the hook for the moment. Yeah, you lying sack of can shit. Get back to work now. Let's get out of here, Phelps. He ain't our guy. He ain't our guy. Let's check your stuff here, Clemens. I, I'm suspicious of you. I don't know, Clemens. I don't trust you, man. I don't trust I've you. I've got a big backlog of these things to install. How about leaving me to get on with it? How about you shut up and let me fucking meddle with you, bitch? I want to investigate this. What are you even doing? You're not doing anything. Your your hands are literally touching nothing. What are you? You're like fiddling. You're like, ah, uh, I don't know what to do. Ah, uh, what should I do here? Uh, oh, take take that. Nope, nope, not that. Um, let me see. Maybe if I just keep moving my hands around like this, it'll seem like I'm working. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, I'm gonna type with a keyboard now. I'm gonna make keyboard motions. All right. Uh, damn it, I don't know what to do. Oh, I have hands. Okay. Uh, hmm. Okay, definitely not that again. Uh, nope, not that one. All right. Uh. God damn it, Clemens, you suck. If anything is proven to me now is that you suck at your job and you don't actually know what you're doing. I'm taking your car. Damn it, I can't. Alright, partner, where do next? Let's go meet the next shit bag on our list. Um Varley. Alright, this is the guy who was wanted by Varley's Detroit. On the run. He might be packing heat. Alright. He's wanted for murder. I say we take the dot out of the equation and let him have it. You nervous? It's been a while. You were in combat. In 1917. Whoa. You know, I never fired my weapon in the line of duty. Ouch. Really? That's nothing to be ashamed of. Mm. I hope your beast is still serviceable, Herschel. I may be old and out of practice, but I'm still a Marine, Phelps. <laughs> it would be better for our case if we could bring him in, Herschel. That's true. I think Herschel and Bukowski are probably the most reasonable so far. Well, yeah. 
and the most reasonable of our partners so far. And uh definitely definitely not Rusty and the, the shit bag. What's his name? Freaking Hollywood pretentious Hollywood wannabe douche. Frick. LAPD Varley. Shoot him. Stop or I'll shoot. He's like, you're not gonna shoot, Cole. Don't be stupid. You're trying to say I had to scare him. Maybe I'll shoot though. Oh, okay, you're supposed to aim it at him, right? I was kind of forgetting that. I was like wondering, like, oh wait, how do I do that again? Do I have to press it? Do I have to hold down space or something? Uh, aha! <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not. I'm bluffing, but you're gonna fall for it. What the hell, partner? <laughs> he just walked through my gun. He just ran through my gun. What the fuck? How do you get away with that easy? You're under arrest for committing a I mean, series of arsons. You're also under arrest for murder. Detroit PD will be putting in a request. For Wait, why are we arresting him for arsons? We don't know about that. Your guess is arson. You You're... can't hang that rap on me. Be quiet. Yeah, it's true. We can't really. Are all the cops in this town crazy? We don't. We have no evidence that he was the arsonist. Why the hell are we jumping to that conclusion? Just because he ran? Cop logic. All right, let's go. Next, next, next guy. We're gonna go harass. <laughs> And probably kill. Um, all right. I'm actually surprised we haven't killed anyone yet. All right, let's do this. Oh wow, he's right over here. Oh shit, he probably heard the gunshots. I'd be surprised if he didn't run. Well. Wow. I'd be surprised that he's still here, doing his thing. Are you Matthew Ryan? Who's asking? Detective Phelps oh, hey, I know him. Arson squad. Arson. You heard the man. Well, just put this stuff in the car. I never remember the actors names and exactly who they are and what they did. What I know them from, but I always oh, reckon I tend to recognize them. So. Hey, look, it starts me off. That's good. Ah, oh, get you, bitch. Those are GIs back Come on, Herschel. Shoot him. Shoot his tires. Is He's a one-man wrecking ball. Move in. I'll take out the van. Cosmetic? What are you talking about? What damage is only cosmetic? Oh. His car? Oh shit! Oh, that damage wasn't just cosmetic. Kill those men. They'll get out of the way. Only if they hear him coming. Close in, Phelps. We need to take Ryan down before he hurts somebody. He already did. Uh, a little late for that one, Chief. A little closer. Wait, I don't. I don't remember you having such a Boston-y accent or whatever. Enough games, Phelps. Take this guy out. Oh god. Such a northeastern accent. Oh shit. He's got an arson related assault charge and he's running. Running don't mean nothing. We gotta get this guy in a room before we can get an angle on him. This yeah, not just say that he's arrested stop. already. <laughs> oh god. Before we even have any evidence. Wait, is he actually done? Get he's actually not done yet. Really? Tar. There we go. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, if he actually tries to get away like that, it's like, it's like, wow, really? Put your hands where I can see them. Yeah, Why bitch. You run, Ryan? I was scared. You got a reason to be scared, Ryan? Yeah, Ryan. Ryan I'm arresting you on suspicion of committing a series of arsons. Ha ha! Wow, that was kind of abrupt. All right. I guess he had no objection to that. He was just like, okay. You know, I'm kind of upset about it, but you know, it is what it is. LAPD life. <laughs> we have three suspects. As much as I'd like it to be Chapman, I think it's one of the other two guys. Who's Chapman? Let's get to the station and close this case. Wait, who's Chapman? What? Who's Chapman? I don't. Partner. Hmm. I guess we'll do that. Oh, shit. Where's your respect for property? Where's your respect for shutting up? Let me do my thing. Bitch. Oh, okay. I could let him dry, but I think I'm just gonna ignore that one. A hit and run? Eh, I don't really wanna do that. This gives me I'm gonna chase someone again. I don't wanna do car chases, I wanna shoot like people. Mark, Unless a hit and run leads to a shootout, but I I don't wanna take I don't wanna take the chances. 
So yeah, I'm just going for it. Boop, 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 I'm just going for the interview, I mean. Or the PlayStation, whatever. Doop, doop, doop. I really don't remember how this one ends. Oh shit. Do I interview all three of them? I don't remember. All I know is that the night is young. Well, it's not there yet, but it's coming. At uh, church. Isn't that funny? We, s we experienced a church not too long ago. I mean, okay, it was back in Homicide, but it was... Right around the time I'm doing this recording is actually when I've uploaded uh, part 25, so... I have two suspects. Thumbs, you got nothing. <laughs> Biggs. What are you Brian's saying? Waiting for you in interview one. Oh, right. Oh, Everyone's being an asshole hey, to me. I forgot. You practicing your asshole routine again? Come on, Phelps. Yeah, fuck you, Hopkins. Anthony Hopkins. Who, you, who do you think you are, Hannibal Lecter? Bitch. Save yourself some time and get this thing off your chest. Uh oh, I hope there's no glitch in this if one. If that's your opening gambit, you better try again. Okay. Uh... Don't save yourself some time. Uh, let me shoot you. There you go. I got ya. Haha. -ha. Okay, let's start with your anarchist literature for some reason. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part. Well, it depends yes, in am. what sense. Does that include no, sabotaging water heaters? I think everyone wants to change something. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh... You don't, this is do you? industrial sabotage, Ryan. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional to Your anarchist campaign. What campaign? To turn, to turn the world, to turn America into anarchism through politics. <laughs> Which seems kind of ironic, but... Let's see. Um... I'm sorry? Uh, you're delusional. What campaign? Oh. Hold on. Uh, I'm kind of confused now. Uh, this campaign? Your locker is full of pamphlets. Clemens told us how you were always foisting them on people. Sure. Foisting them. The pamphlets. Bitch. A guy has foisting. to do something. Something, man. Insta heat heaters break down every day. You guys gotta do something. They're still peddling the same lousy design that they lifted from Hesphaistos. Well, we know that's out. true. Them, Vulcan, Pyro, and a bunch of <gasps> Pyro. And you still work. For I them. play that sometimes the in TF2. To work <laughs> the of the company. How do you feel about them these days? Well, why am I getting so angry now? Yeah, he probably doesn't feel very good about them. It's anarchist after all. Do you know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. Oh, really? You could just say you do, and then... You know, it doesn't necessarily you mean you did it. You know enough to do your job. You know enough to do that repair. You're lying, Ryan. That'd be a good doubt. How do you think you can prove that? Would be that? A, that would be a good doubt to just go off of. But, alright, I guess... He said it in lie. Uh, do I say... I, I don't know. I don't know. Testifies to ease. Oh. He said it's really easy to do, apparently. I didn't know that. Uh. I guess it is, I mean, but... I guess he did say it was a subtle change, but so I guess I wouldn't be much like this? to do. Keep dreaming, copper. Uh, but hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Repellent, mosquito repellent coils. Wait, what am I looking at this for? I don't know. Um, let's see. So, do I say this? If you don't ask, you never find out. Uh. Uh. 
Okay, I'm gonna go with that probably. You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regular uh, I'm just gonna go with that. No, I don't. I feel like it might be doubt. You know to do your job. But you know enough to do that repair. why else would we have that so testifies to ease thing there? And how do you think you can prove that? You know? I'm gonna go with it, I don't care. Hi yeah. Your boss at Insta Heat said that you've all been trained to do it. It's a common repair. Are you calling him a liar? <sighs> Okay. Call your boss a liar. Oh, oh my done. god. But what would be the point? You'd just end up with a gas leak and then a small fire when you turn the pilot back on. And if you didn't Ooh. reset the pilot and the gas spread, what was the cause of the fire in your own home, Ryan? Hmm. I won't tell you. <laughs> well, that's not suspicious. Wait, so you know? Wait. Did you say the fire in his own home? Oh. Wait, he had a fire in his own home? Okay, I'm lost. I'm, I, 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 I am coming back from this after, like, so many days, and when I replayed it, I didn't really pay full attention, but uh, let's see, because I just kind of wanted to get through it to get to where I am. I can wait just as long as you can. Okay, we can play a waiting game if you want. What can you I'm tell me about it. the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. Wow, you're full of answers, buddy. Tell me the truth, Ryan. It's the only chance you've got. You're getting some kind of kickback from the fund. So I'm an agitator for change, but I take kickbacks. How does that make any sense? Uh, it's a front. It's a front. You're trying to play everyone. Like a little bitch. Well, it doesn't really connect. Hmm. Why am I looking at this? I don't know. Uh, list of gas fitters. Okay, I don't think... There's nothing to suggest. Nothing this personal. is true. I'm just doing my job. You understand that. Wait. What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. No, he's looking kind of iffy. I think suburban is a front for your oh, I'm on it. To I was right. While you burn their houses down. Oh. Suburban? Well, I don't know. I What's was thinking that, that but <laughs> I didn't know she's that far in it. Bilk. He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. Yeah, it's actually true. We know about that little kickbacks thing. You have a it all comes problem. together. I have no such thing. Oh, okay, that's a total lie. <laughs> We know for sure that one is a lie. How exactly are you gonna prove that? But do you realize we have like, we know with the police, right? We have records of this stuff. It's not like some totally nebulous thing out there that you did this. <laughs> you were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. It's a point of lying about that. Criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible oh. got away with it. We see the link oh, now. You do. Which company has faced those water heater companies? Oh, bought out by the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Or something like that, right? Oh, it's getting intense now. Oh. I'm almost not going to go yet. Ryan? So I can go? Sure. As soon as you're ready. I'm pretty sure it's not him. Communism is not the same thing as anarchism. God damn it. Shut up, assholes. God damn, it's like they're like they're kind of they're kinda of like really different in a lot of ways. I mean But procedure says we eliminate all of the suspects. Like speak to Bar. I don't think Ryan is our man, but okay. Unless he just got like really agitated. But it doesn't really make sense. I mean, the, it, it, I it seems to only be helping them, so you know you the, it seems to only be helping the company. So I don't know why he would do that. Where where are we going? Hey Ryan, I don't care about you right now. Uh, okay. I want to make homicide. I mean, you know you've made it if you got that death. Yeah, well, I got it before. Suck on that bitch. All right, so we're only talking to two guys, right? It's always it's always only up to two because what what's his face got? 
we have got away. Well, not got away, Marley. but I we, didn't, we, need we didn't take him in. Him about this and he'll rat you out. Fuck Ryan. Oh, wait, no. Bastard. Are we talking to two other guys? Oh, I don't know. Hold on. Uh, Varley. You see, he... Um... Okay. Have you ever worked on a place on Rosewood Avenue? Family by the name of Sawyer? Maybe. I, I'm from out of town. Yeah, yes or no? I, I, I don't do a lot of repairs out here. I'm, I'm flying oh. on new installations. Oh, okay. So you Why just... Are you lying to me, Varley? So you just only work part-time. So you work for the company, but you don't actually do, like, half the work. <laughs> uh -huh. So I'm lying just because I can't remember if I was there or not? <laughs> How can you prove that I was? Oh. Here we go. Your name is on the inside door of their water heater. Unless someone just put that in okay. and framed you, but... <laughs> you got me there. I mean... <laughs> Suburban? So, y so you knew out. you were lying. Sawyer kept complaining about not being able to get his heater service, so they threw in a free service as a sweet. I think he played him, though. Because he still wouldn't sell. Hope you didn't hear that. I'm just slurping a little bit. Uh, um, my drink. Let's see. Suburban redevelopment. Yeah, let's talk about that. Or it is, you're in the pocket of some property developer? Never. I got principles. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, you have principles. <laughs> How did Suburban put the squeeze yeah, Those principles being to be in the pocket of property There's developers. No <laughs> You're wasting your time. Okay. Um, well, we got Walter Clemens' statement. Oh. Let's do this one. Ryan this is more specific. On the kickbacks they were offering. I'll testify. Bourbon, I got real time pressure on getting some of the big developments finished. There's some big. Man, you just are nervous about it. Like, I just caught you in your line. You're just like, yeah, okay. <laughs> so did a lot of guys, all right? Carpenters, electricians, plumbers. It's no big conspiracy. So why do you have to hide it, huh? Why are you so guilty then, bitch? What would reversing the diaphragm of an Insta Heat Model 70 do? Yeah, I made that mistake before. You get a big bang when you turn your pilot back on. So you didn't deliberately sabotage the water heater at the Sawyer house? No, I did not. You out of your mind? Wait. Did you not already admit that you did that? What? <laughs> Hold on. Was I just not paying attention? I think he played them, though. Oh. Oh, he didn't. He never went to specifics. He basically implied that he fucking did it for them, though. Right? We want that guy out. Yeah, yeah. He kind of implied it. Let's see. So, if he was offered, he was being offered kickbacks, and they were pissed off at this guy for playing them. Then obvious, and he was there servicing his heater, then, yeah, it seems pretty reasonable that you probably the one who did it. Although, you think they'd cover their tracks a little bit better than that, but, you know. Companies ain't always the brightest. That's for sure. I don't believe you, Varley. I think Suburban wants homeowners who don't want to sell out of the way. But you just, yeah, you said that. Mind. You, no, you already admitted that part. You said that. To contribute to this fire, huh? Uh, hmm, that's interesting, actually. I don't know. Uh... So, mm -hmm. so you got a statement, Barley's record for murder, mosquito coils, oh. Would that work? I mean... Our partner did say that the mosquito repellent coils would help out with the thing, with the fi with setting off the fire, because it would give him a chance to run away. It provided a delay for the explosion. The explosion! But, um... I don't know if I should say that. 
Um, so what evidence do you have? I mean, that's not really evidence. I mean, yeah, it's, it's kind of circumstantial. I mean, hey, it is, right? Why don't you stand around some more while I sneak out that door? I guess it's still circum. I guess it's still evidence, but it's circumstantial evidence. Sorry. Sometimes you have to shake the tree to see what falls out. Okay, this one's a bit of a stumper. I'm gonna have to do it again. What would reversing the diaphragm of an Insta Heat Model Seven would do? Yeah, I made that mistake before. So he's pretty genuine here. You get a big bang when you turn the pilot back on. So you didn't deliberately sabotage the water heater at the source. And then here he gets really no, nervous. No, I did not. You out of your mind? He starts looking away, and he looks really incredulous or whatever. Um, he's definitely lying in some way, but I just. So are you out of your mind? Oh, okay. I said something after that. Are you out of your mind? I mean, <sighs> should I take a chance here? I don't believe you, Varley. I, I kind of want to do intuition, but then I won't feel as good about myself. So. <laughs> I think you're out of your mind. Where is the evidence that I have done anything to contribute to this fire? Huh? And I want to feel good about myself. Now, don't I? Yes, I do. Where's the evidence that you've done anything to contribute to this fire? I don't think it was... Okay, cool. And mosquito coils is time delay fuses. Cool, cool. We found an open box of mosquito coils in your locker. Circumstantial, well, but... Hang on! <laughs> Those things, they belong to Ryan, alright? He asked me to hold them because oh, really? his locker's full of stupid pamphlets. I thought he used them for camping. Do we have someone else to talk to? Or... Is it just you two? I think it was just those two, right? Yeah, we're gonna have to go back quite a bit here, but we can do it. Boom, boom, boom. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I just wanna be sure. Uh... We have three suspects. Chapman. I, I don't remember Chapman. This was the last time I played. I don't remember Chapman. Okay. I'm gonna go with him. Reginald Varley, I'm charging you with committing a series of arsons and for the murders of Hank Sawyer, Edwina Sawyer, Henry Sawyer, and Jessica Sawyer. I'm no cold Yeah, criminal. bitch. I could never bring and Tom Sawyer, too. Own. Well, I don't think it was the other guy. I don't know why he would do it anyway. How is it? No, just keep your mouth shut and listen to me for a second. Oh, what? How is it you can bring no less than three suspects into my station, conduct extensive interviews, sift through mountains of evidence with Lynch and Pinker, and still manage to charge the wrong fucking guy? How? What? I took a chance on you, Phelps. The people said I was crazy, and you made me look like oh, a Oh, wait a minute. You may not be much of an arson investigator, but I hear you're merciless on the beat. Get going. Hold on. I think this is exactly what getting the right one means. Because isn't there kind of like a whole... My angle is that there's a whole big conspiracy going on behind this. And the fact that I got the right guy probably pisses them off. Wait, really? So you're saying it was Ryan? Oh. Uh. But w w what's the evidence there? I don't. There was not a whole lot of convincing things there. Like, yeah, he's an anarchist. He has like some ideas, but. Like, what does that have to do with burning down houses? Like, how does that serve him? It just serves a company that he hates. 
I mean, the company that bought out that company, which he probably by proxy hates, because it's continuing the same things. It's doing the same things, so... Like... If... If he was not responsible for his own house burning down, and it was... T and it, was, it, was it was a faulty heater or whatever that his family got killed by... From the company... And that, and that type of heater is still being installed... I don't think he would want to sabotage it to just... Unless he was trying to get them ousted. But... That doesn't seem to be working. No, it only seems to serve their purposes from the sound of it. So it seemed like it was the other guy. I don't know, I'm going to look this up later. If this was legitimately the wrong choice, then damn. But if it was just between Varley and Ryan, then... I don't know, or at least seem more likely. Maybe I have to go look over again. I don't I don't know if I was paying attention as much of Ryan. Maybe maybe I missed something or forgot something. I don't know. We'll see.